at the 2023 Dubai Air Show, Russia first introduced the new RVV MD2 short range air to air missile to the international community. RVV MD2 is designed specifically for the fifth generation Su 57 Phalon style fighters of the Russian Aerospace Forces. The missile is designed to be compatible with the Su 57's internal weapons bay. However, the Su-34 all-weather supersonic medium-range fighter bomber and the Su-35 and Su-30SM fighters can also be equipped with them. According to Rosaboro Export, the manufacturer of the RVV MD-2, it was the first short-range missile to use an initial control system which is intended to stabilize and regulate the missile during autonomous flight. The new missile can strike targets from all directions, especially in the rear hemisphere. To put it another way, the RVV MD2 is fired forward, spins in mid-air, and hits an enemy aircraft hiding behind the Su-57. The RVV MD-2 missile has a combined guidance system that consists of a radio correction receiving channel, a multi-element double channel infrared seeker with enhanced interference resistance, and initial guidance. Regardless of outside influences, the missile can autonomously determine its coordinates. The front hemisphere homing seekers 180 degree scanning area enables tracking own hostile aircraft evasion movements. The cylindrical body of the RVV MD2 measures 0.7 meters in diameter and 2.92 meters in total length. The warhead has 8 kilograms of explosives and its large weight is roughly 106 kilograms. Russian media has iterated that the missile could destroy targets flying at a speed of 2,500 km per hour at an altitude of between 20 and 20,000 meters. The new homing head can be driven in azimuth 180 degrees which ensure the lock-on of targets during their maneuvering. RVV MD2 is equipped with a single-stage, single-mode solid fuel motor with gas dynamic control system spoilers, which allow the rocket to perform maneuvers with high over G. The maximum flight range is up to 50 km, and the maximum acceleration is up to 12 G. The RVV MD can operate effectively from any direction, day or night, amid challenging electronic countermeasure environments. The new missile possesses several advantages that Russian media claims will render highly effective and lethal in air warfare. With the RVV MD2 carrying worth these advanced features and enhancements, it promises to elevate the combat capabilities of the Su-57 fighter jet even further. The decision to showcase these missiles at the Dubai Air Show is significant when Russia pushes to export its Su-57 style fighter jets to friendly countries and potential customers. Despite coordinated efforts over the last few years, the Su-57 has no buyers. In fact, on the first day of the air show, representatives from the Russian government stated that they were hoping to find partners for the Su-75 checkmate development program in addition to drawing interest in the Su-57E, the country's export version of the fifth generation fighter. The Su-57 is a fifth-generation mountain fighter 
distinguished by its Dell Technologies and Advanced Electronics Incorporation. Designed for versatility, this combat vehicle can carry weapons within the internal compartments of its fuselage. Russia is the third country with fifth-generation aircraft beside the United States and China. Despite several failures encountered during the development of the Su-57, Moscow is still convinced that this fighter plane could eventually become an essential piece of defense technology, serving as a vital tool in discouraging possible enemies. Russia's military sector is actively working to maintain production levels to supply the Russian aerospace forces with fresh batches of Su-57s, notwithstanding Russia's involvement in the conflict with Ukraine. The aircraft is said to have been deployed against Ukraine, albeit in a limited fashion. It has reportedly carried out stealthy patrols along the border and fired long-range missiles from the Russian airspace. As it continues to market at the few air show and exhibitions, it is there allowed to participate in. Russia is also constantly adding more advanced features to the Su-57 to bolster its combat capabilities. For instance, the aircraft has now been equipped with a second-stage engine, the East Delia R-30.